What's up guys? Jordan here from Artisan Electrics. No, you can cut. Hello and welcome back to Artisan Electrics for this very special episode. <laughs> what? I really think that first one should stay. I just have to have a peek. Can I feel the grade of paper? Yeah, some serious moves back then. What happened about the Pringles thing? Let's talk about that. <laughs> Come up with this stuff. And allocate the circumcision to Let's just go to Hawaii. You sound like Barry White. Can you tell that I've never used a pair of scissors before? Hello and welcome back to Artisan Electrics for this very special episode because we are celebrating the fact that we've just received our 100,000 subscriber plaque. We've got a bottle of Artisan luxurious French beer. We've got a pair of scissors. I'm going to drink that. I'm going to cut Corey's hair and everything's going to go down. I've run out of hair there. gel. I just got out of the shower. But seriously guys, the plaque is here. My beautiful assistant, Luke, just out of shot there. This is it. I can't believe it. Little backstory about this, right? The box is all a bit smushy. That's because this arrived while I was away on holiday and it's been sitting in the rain for like two weeks. So I'm a little bit scared that it's gonna be completely ruined. Oh, if it's rusty, that would be so bad. Let's see. <laughs> I'm genuinely, um, this is I'm genuinely not. I think it would be more special though, because either. how many YouTubers have a rusty plaque? Just gonna hack it open. Can you tell that I've never used a pair of scissors before? Oh, it's so. Oh. I just have to have a peek before I have a sniff. Oh, it's got foam. It's got nice foam. Look. Oh, it right. does have a smell to it, Max. You're right. Okay. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's cool. There's a little letter. Some 100,000 subscribers. Just how far have you come? Yours sincerely, Susan Wojcicki, I think that's right. And Rick. CEO of who, YouTube. Who packaged it. Our little friend Rick. Can YouTube. I feel the grade of paper? That they've... Just, it's very damp, unfortunately. Oh yeah, that is very damp. But it is nice. <gasps> this is it. <laughs> Look at hey, that. Look at that, that is nice. That's a... Oh, it's not even rusty either. Right, let's get, let's get that box out of the way. Do the big reveal, look at that. Presented to Artisan Electric for passing 100,000 subscribers. Fortunately, it was in a plastic bag, so it's not too wet. Look at that. Nice. Wow. Oh yeah, I feel the it's weight of like it. A nice little bit of felt on the back. There you go, Corey. You have the second oh, holding that. experience. Oh, it's nice. Let's, ha let's have some beer first. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. This is artisan beer. It's from France. It's called um, French Luxury Beer. This one's called Confession, and it's 14%. It's actually a bit of a joke that I had with Corey because we had three of these over the last few days. The first one was called Punishment. Yeah. I'll just have that. That would do. Cheers. Yeah, yeah. Still got to drive to the pub. Oh, that is so nice. Oh, that is really That's nice. That's gorgeous. That is the kind of thing is that, that French? That is deceptively... Oh, I'm going to guess it's French. That is deceptively strong. That tastes like a Belgian. 14%. That's like a wine. Anyway, we digress. Obviously, I started the channel in 2016, but I didn't do much with it for, for a little while. Mm. And it really got going. I beg to differ. I've really enjoyed the footage of you beekeeping and stuffing your face with cereal. I forgot about the beekeeping video. I think that a lot of people that, was, that are watching this probably... That was a moment probably... of desperation. I took that out of the archives. I'm secretly a beekeeper. A closet beekeeper. Yeah, yeah. closet beekeeper. To get to 100,000 subscribers, a lot has happened. I mean, when I first started making videos, it was just me with my phone. We got to about 40 odd thousand subscribers at the end of 2020. Then Corey came on board. Do you remember the first video that you did? You or, or you my, went, my first ever video was with you. Yeah, the first, yeah. So Where like, you slice your finger open on a blade. Well, yeah. On the drone. And I remember, I remember watching and I, I thought, you put the drone up and you're like, oh yeah, I'm going to like put my hand over it and that's going to fade into the next sequence. That's a cool idea. I thought, well, that camera's awfully close to the blades. I remember thinking, you've done this before. This is my first day. I'm, who am I to question you? And then literally you go, <laughs> blood spurting everywhere. I just slashed. I and that slashed. was my first impression. Slashed my hand on a drone. I think really I was. Deep, I think really I was cut. as nervous as you were on that day because it was like your first day 
for you as an employee of Artisan. And a horrendously was... tight t-shirt. I had one of your t-shirts and I'd oh, like yeah. my back and belly hanging out. You had some serious moves back then. I did, yeah, thank you for reminding me. I appreciate that. No, mate, you know, it just shows how far you've come, really. <laughs> Oh, no, I'm, you're, I'm you're, much more, you, you're much more fit for camera nowadays. Yeah, yeah. No, I appreciate that. Do you remember what you were like when you were first on camera? I hated it. I mean, I still can't say I love it. I was just so confused because obviously we discussed working. I remember you saying about doing videos, I was expecting like some kind of, I don't know, like promotional marketing or something. Or I, I just never really heard of electrician blogs before in that sense. I, I'm not really much of a... TV or YouTube watcher, to be honest. When like the whole vlog thing kicked off, I was like, oh my goodness, <laughs> what have I got myself into? <laughs> but I mean, that was still back in the GoPro days. And now like, we've got a cameraman, Max Legend, standing behind the camera right now. He's set up all the lighting. Overpaid we've got his professional time. microphone set up. We've got uh, Nathan, who is just doing the editing now because there's so much work to do editing. We've got Elijah, our social media manager, now working in the background to I help like, plan first day. the videos. Yeah, I remember Nathan's first day too, but with a box of chocolates, the Anderson install. My customers bought these for us, artisan bonbons, and they're actually amazing. They're frozen. They're saying, I'm the artisan, electrical chief. Which is really nice thing to say, but I'm not. Yeah, because... Nathan, obviously I've been friends with Nathan for years and he did camera work and... Yeah, I remember you messaging me and you were like, I've got this mate and he's a really good cameraman. I you see. should have a look at his stuff. He's, he's like available, maybe we should try him out. I don't know if I said he was good. So he's all right. I, I, like, yeah. He's passable. I and I was like, oh, this guy's, this guy's good. Like mm. maybe we should just try it out and see what the impact would be of increasing the quality of the YouTube videos. Mm. Yeah, Nathan's first day, but then he and grew then to it. And then that was it, really. We kind of never turned back. Well, like, you couldn't. Once you, you've raised one, the bar, you can't. That's it. I remember trying to do a GoPro video again after that, and people were like, what's happened? Like, because yeah. you get used to that standard. And just having like B-roll and good music mm. and all of that stuff. I mean, let us know in the comments, guys, because I know a lot of you have been watching since the start, and you watched, you enjoyed the videos when they were just like me with my phone and then Corey on the GoPro. But let us know if you appreciate the improvement in quality because I think a lot of people do and that's why our viewership has grown massively and that's probably why we've got to have I worked hard on it to train Nathan and Max to get to where they are with their camera skills. Yeah. Like, it took me ages. I taught him everything he knew. And, and, and I then, taught you and everything then, you know. So Exactly. And, you know. So... Elijah and Nathan, our social media manager and our editor, have come up with a list of videos. We don't know what videos they've chosen. They want us to watch certain segments of those videos that we've made in the past and react to them. Okay? So the first one is this. It's the first ever video that I made on the channel on the 14th of May 2016. Here we go. Is that a light fitting? That is a light, that's an emergency light. How's it got that much water coming it's out of it? It's absolutely full of water. Did you poke a hole in it or something? No, that was literally I found it. an emergency it light have a and water I found it or something, and it was half full of water. And I thought, this is shocking. Let's share it on YouTube. And so I filmed an 11 second video of the water pouring out and that was my YouTube debut. This is where I've gone wrong in life. Something yeah. like that, I'd be like, I'm gonna tell my mum. So Corey's first video, which was uh, posted on November the 19th, 2019. So this is the first video with Corey in it, basically. And it was your first day of work. I mean, yeah, that's the day I my, plunged my, my, my. you right in at the deep end and it was like, oh, new, new artisan team member, let's film his first day. How yeah. about that for no pressure? Oh. Right, let's just, oh um, let's just look at you, chubby boy. Oh. Right, let's go to the start and let's see what the intro is. Well, good morning, everyone. Jordan here from Artisan Electric. You sound like Welcome to Barry this White. Special it's oh, good exciting. morning, everyone. Very special and exciting. Oh, the history of Artisan Electrics because today is the first day that I am hiring <coughs> or starting with my new employee, Corey. The first ever proper <coughs> on the books electrician. That's an aggressive swallow. Hired I used to do that a lot actually in the videos. Today is his first working day. It's 5.30 a.m. I'm here in the van and I'm just Did you just look at your coat and tell me it was 5.30 a.m.? Yeah, I did actually have a watch somewhere. 3.46. Quarter past the freckle. Southwest. So then right, let's skip to where you... Let's just skip to the noobs. Let's just get it over and done with. Right, here we go. 
Oh my days, the t-shirt colours were so you ready? horrendous. We've got a and, and this was when now. my previous, so this was before Nathan, we had, I had an editor um, and he edited this. Did, was that your first impression of me? Did you actually think I had moves? No. Oh, okay, it was just in the video. Oh yeah, that is moves. Oh, you look, like, I how, how have you aged so much? Women. And soon to be employee of the month and employee of the year. Oh, interesting. I predicted that you would actually be employee of the day, employee of the month, and employee of the year. How long has it been since then? It's over 365 days, so that's mm. well past. Don't yeah. worry. Yeah. You're going to have to pull your trousers up, mate. <laughs> oh, mate, I know it's funny to do some press ups. What's, what's my lowest view video? Right, Corey's lowest viewed video. Yeah, I want to see this. Under 5,000 views? I didn't know we had any view videos under that. You need a bit of advice about this one. Let's, like, let's watch this one. Under 5,000 5, views. views. Oh, shut up. Oh. <laughs> Alright, we can leave that out. 15 views. <laughs> first of all, first of all, I didn't release this for you lot. I released that for me, okay? This, is, this song is the reason why I've aged so much since then and the reason why I lost so much weight. So I don't really care if nobody else likes it. <laughs> 115 views is 115 um, more than, 114 if, more than I need. If you like music and you like melancholy madness, go and listen to Corey's single. Well, you sound supportive now, but where was you earlier when I was asking you? We have, right. I've shared it. You tell me what, have you? I no, you haven't. Elijah has. Right. I. We I, have musicians. Got my permission to cheer We have out, musicians okay? on our books. I have musicians' numbers on our phone. Professional musicians that I know that might like this, or they might just laugh at it and say it's rubbish. If you're a professional musician who also is our customer, you know but who Jordan you said, are. I think it's inappropriate for you to message them. I might. Like, there I'm is not, a line, Corey. You I'm need not to, sending them shirtless you, you pictures. You need to learn these lines. Yet. I'm sending them, unless it's Ellie right. Roswell of Wolf Alice. If she watches this, I'm sorry, I'll Look, break Corey, them. your lowest I viewed will break video. All professional boundaries, every your, single one of them. Your lowest viewed video is not actually as pathetic as in my lowest viewed video, so okay, let's, watch. Lowest viewed video, let's watch this. How to test batteries. I'll tell you how I test batteries. Ask Ruben to lick them. I bought this really cheap battery tester off of e uh, Amazon or something Super and I Amazon I don't even know why I did it I just I guess I needed to test some batteries Amazon and I thought oh I might as well make a video about how to test batteries it's had 1085 views absolutely pathetic probably cost the same and I learned I kind of learned from a lot of my tool videos that not everyone who watches the channel wants to see tools so that's why I created a separate tools channel called tools for sparks subscribe to that one if you haven't done so already mm. Uh, what else? Corey's highest viewed video. Okay, this is, this is getting better now. 202,000. 202,000 views. A day in the life of an electric uh, vehicle charging port and install that. that. Lovely Anderson dog. AT. I had a beagle, I think. Yeah, Anderson A2 that. installation. Yeah. I feel like the Blink-182 album cover. However, there's a load of pipes boxed into that corner. I've not drilled through a pipe yet in my career and I do not plan <laughs> on today being the day that I start. So Yeah, I hadn't worked in that many houses. Is up, <laughs> along, avoid that. Drill through there. Lovely, what a legend. I've not yeah, drilled yeah, through a pipe in my career. That was when it all went down here, wasn't it? Down pipe, like a section. <laughs> oh. I hope I took credit for that. Exactly. You've taken credit for so many of my tips. You, that was your tip. That was my tip. I hope I took you credit for took it. Credit for? Did I take credit for it? Now, I know that when I slide my drill bit down there. That's how it feels. <laughs> Here we have a uh, Spidacus Maximus. You can tell that by the number of legs it has. Most spiders have I nine legs. Like this one looks like it may have lost its ninth leg in a fight. <laughs> spiders have nine legs. <laughs> I think um, spiders well, have I mean, eight legs, to be honest. I would imagine that was the joke. But, uh, I, but I liked you. I did like your David Attenborough impression. Yeah. That was quite impressive. Um, Maybe we should get you to do some kind of narration for uh, next Johnson. programs. <laughs> right, what else we got in here? Five, 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 seventeen, six, eight, two. Man, there's no party. You, this is the amazing thing about Corey. He's just a constant stream of one-liners, which is why people love watching. If it's more than one one-liner, is it still a one one-liner? It's like one liner after another one-liner. Right. Okay. This is a alligator circumcision tool. <laughs> <laughs> See where do you come up with this stuff? An alligator know, circumcision tool. I'm not sure, to be honest with you. But you, have you like had a previous life working in a zoo? 
Mm, if I was, I don't know if you actually need to circumcise alligators. I'm not sure if that's... This is why this video went down so well, because it's just like punch. It's so punchy. It's like boom, one liner, another boom, one liner, cutting a padlock off. It's just like... And this is what we're trying to do more and more in the videos, is just fill them with interesting and entertaining segments so that people don't get bored. It's funny because it's the first time in my life where I've ever profited from being a moron. Yeah, well, you know, <laughs> it's the start of many good things, Corey. Mm. I've been doing it for a while now. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Let's just talk about what our favourite videos have been. My favourite video that we've ever made, I still think is a really good video, is the Probably one... Probably Magnolia Sunrise, actually. Can't yeah. think of it. Mm, yeah. yeah. No, I wasn't in that one. I clicked refresh 115 times. <laughs> I think mine is the day that we were together and the customer rewired his own house, that one. Look at what the cat dragged in. Disastrous, despicable. More batter on it than a Scottish Mars bar. The banter was just flowing that day. Like, I was ripping into you because you your van was a complete mess. Voila! Corey, I'm going to dock your pay the, the price it costs Kim and Aggie and Marie Kondo to come out and sort the van for Oh, you. mate, I'll give you my whole disgusting. pay to meet Marie Kondo. She's my idol. Guess what? Nothing's changed. And you were planning little pranks on me. Do you remember you tried to prank call me and with a northern accent? Oh, yeah. You remember that? Yeah, Hello. Remember that, yeah. Oh. Oh, you, you were pretending to be the DNO, that was it, because we yeah. were up near, we were like in Coventry. But or you were just worried about it, because you were putting the main views out, and you're like, oh, the DNO are going to know. I was like, they're not going to know. And I was like, oh, actually, yeah, they might. And then yeah. I tried to call and you. And then he pretended to, like, but he did this really rubbish accent. Hello. Oh, hello. Hello. Oh, hello, you, mum. You, can you hear me? <laughs> Oh, you. You're oh. so rubbish at being on like a oh. northern accent. That was like half northern, half Indian. I don't know Indian. what Brummy is. Brummy is a was like... <laughs> My favourite video is probably Meg Mac covers Tame Impala, Let It Happen, for like a version. I think you're confused. We're talking about favourite artists. Artisan videos, video. right. I liked the one, I liked the Barnard Castle ones. I feel like the Barnard Castle ones it didn't get as many views as they should, really. They, they did not, but... They were good. They were good, entertaining I'm videos. I'm literally starting a fire with friction at the start of it, in a cave, and somehow that didn't go anywhere. Do you think we'll go to Hawaii this year? Well, it all depends. If somebody wants to sponsor Corey to go to Hawaii, if someone wants to chuck, like, 20 grand our way to sponsor Corey That's a lot to of go to Hawaii. That's a lot of me. Uh, to go to Hawaii and do electrics in Hawaii. If you want to be our sponsor for that, if you think that would help your brand in some way. Please. Please feel free to sponsor a Corey to go to Hawaii. Yeah, a friend has reached out to me, an electrician. My background is panel building, partly. And uh, um, obviously men's health modeling. And um, he said, uh, that's how I met Luke. <laughs> he said, um, he said, oh, I've seen you do panel building, I love your videos, come out to Hawaii, end up having a FaceTime call with this guy, oh my days. He was like, just sitting there in his van chatting to me, and I was like, oh, you know, we were talking for probably about an hour, so I'm like, obviously you've finished work. He was like, no, you know, I'm working. He was like, I was like, oh, okay. He's like, yeah, I'm just going to have a quick surf, and then I'm going to go back to the job. I was like, what would you do if I just disappeared off for a surf for a couple of hours and come back to the job? I mean, to be fair, I disappeared off to KFC for a couple of hours and come back to the job, but probably better KFC, have a surf. KFC, Numbers, <laughs> McDonald's. Oh, numbers, what a cafe. Um, in fact, let's talk about that, right? Because there's been this theme on the channel ever since Corey started, and it's been about food. Remember the Pringles thing? I don't know why. why. What happened about the Pringles thing? Let's talk about that. How did that start? It was Nathan stitching me up. No, I don't need that rubbish. My body's a temple. I just want to eat Pringles, not on camera. No. Oh, yeah. That's a good bit of Pringle right there. Our amateur cameraman, part two. Um, it, our other overpaid webcam. <laughs> he just decided, oh, I know what I'm going to do. I know what would be funny. Let's stitch Corey up. I was just eating Pringles, minding my own business, and he's filming me through, like, through window, two windows zoomed in with his... I want to say pervert lens, but his telescopic lens. <laughs> and uh, I'm just standing there eating Pringles. And he's like, 
that was it. That was the end of it. And then every time I'm, I, oh, and once you pop, you can't stop. You know, it that's a true. fact. It doesn't it mean I true. like them, right? It doesn't uh, mean I like them. It just means that I'm a human, okay? And I was eating these Pringles. <laughs> what are you laughing at? <laughs> right, we should have just got a webcam. A webcam the thing is, Corey's, like Corey's a clever boy, right? He's figured out that if, he, if something is shown in the video, mm. then he gets more of it. Ellie so, Roswell. <laughs> so, so the snacks thing, it's just amazing because what has happened is genuinely our customers email me now before, like a few days before the job and say, oh, what snacks does Corey want? Chicken satay. That's my weakness. They weakness. actually ask me that. What snacks yeah. does Corey want when he arrives? It's like, it's like some kind of celebrity who's got their like knock list of the things no, that they I, need in their changing that way, room. Even before Artisan. Like, Barnard Castle, none of them watch Artisan. I don't think they have the internet. There. You just look like you need feeding. You've got, oh, like, a sign on your forehead their moves. saying... Their moves were fed hungry, by Barnard Castle. Hungry I literally teenager. arrive at Barnard Castle, and the, little, the village there, they know me. Like, yeah, I'm basically... I'm, prob- I'm just texting Dominic Cummins and get him to share my video. Probably. They've been making you cookies, um, and you've yeah, been watching them I down. I get there. You've been wolfing those cookies down. I'm, I'm not kidding. I've got... Wendy, who makes me the short, um, the gingerbread. I've got all these old ladies that will just bake for me. And it's fantastic. I absolutely love it. I think probably because I just chat to everybody and um, I don't know, maybe they just think I look hungry. I'm not sure. If you would like to sponsor a hungry teenager for just three Pringles a week, you maybe can we provide could do a Patreon for the Hawaii smile episode. for Corey That's and his fellow electricians. Go fund me. Let's do a GoFundMe. Let's just go to Hawaii. Let's sack YouTube. We've done. We've hit 100,000 subscribers. That's like more than anyone mm. could ever ask for anyway. I've made my first million. Let's yeah. go to Hawaii and, um, you know, we'll see where it ends up. Yeah. Maybe we'll make videos about making surfboards or something. With that bombshell, we are going to end this video, but we want to thank all of you for your amazing support because without all of you, we could not have done this. 100,000 subscribers is huge. I feel so supported. It's a big stadium full of people. And, you know, thanks to you guys, Corey has been fed amazing snacks for the past year. So that in itself is worth a massive thank you. So thank you. And if for some reason you're watching this video and you're not a subscriber, please just ask yourself a few questions about your life decisions because subscribing to Artisan Electric is probably one of the best decisions you'll make this year. We've got loads more amazing I think we should coming up. Yeah, like Hawaii for a start. Um, um, we've got to thank yeah. the 115 loyal subscribers as well, followers yeah. that actually... 115, um, what's the word? Uh, Sympathics. Uh, can we call them people? I'm Sympathetics. Sure. Are they human? Um, the 115 bots. Mm who Corey paid to watch his music video. <laughs> I actually didn't even know it had that many. I'm quite complimented. I thought it only had about five. So I'll take that. I'll take that. But anyway, guys, leave us all your comments below. We'd love to hear from you. And we want to know what kind of content you would like us to produce in the next year, you know? Mm. Now we've got this great team, what we're trying to do is plan more content. And you guys, you know what you want to watch. So if we can produce the kind of content that you want to see, that would make us happy too. So let us know all your thoughts in the comments below. Like, subscribe if you haven't done so already. Especially. And we'll see you on the next one. Especially if you're Ellie Broswell. And if you're Ellie, from I don't even know who Wolf that is. Alice, the singer from Wolf Alice. Wolf, ah, Can yeah. you just add that, please? Yeah, well, uh, so we need like Ellie Roswell for Corey, and then okay. we need Avril Lavigne, isn't it, for you, Matt? No, I say he dresses like Avril Lavigne. I didn't say he likes Avril Lavigne. Oh, okay, He's got a yeah, that's already. why. He, like, a cameraman likes to have, wear black yeah. nail varnish. And, Loves ripped um, jeans. <sighs> yeah. Like a fellow protein. <laughs> but seriously, guys, thanks for watching this ridiculous episode. It's super exciting for us to be able to unbox the 100,000 subscriber plaque. That's going to be going up on the wall in our new office slash studio. So stay tuned for a little bit of footage about that coming very soon and all the other amazing content that we've got planned. We really appreciate you all watching and thank you. And 